I got some surprise book mail from Pam McMillan, South Africa, Pam McMillan Kids, South Africa. Let's unbox it. <laughs> Hi, welcome to a new video. I'm Shark, Mr. Pink Ink, and today we have a surprise book mail. Um, although it's not really a surprise, but it's great. Um, Pan Macmillan sent it an email, and those of us who answered, we got to make some content for a book that's published today. Happy book birthday to Spud the Reunion that happens uh, 10 years after they matriculate and Spud. He's trying everything in his power to not go, but it seems like that he's going to have to go. So, as a thank you, they sent us this lovely box. This lovely box. Look how nice, look how nice, look how nice. Okay, cool. Okay. Let's have a look. Dun, da, da, da. Ooh, ha, I'm matching, by the way. La, la, la. Look the black. What does it got in there? Hmm. Do we have a card? Oh, this is from the author. Looks like an author card. Author notes. Author letter. That seems fine. And then. Yeah. We have a leather press inspired collection classic leather notebook. How awesome is that? How awesome is that? There's a thing in the back there if you want to go and have a look at that. <laughs> then Okay. Looks like this is a like kind of like a read along or something. Oh, uh, this is all the events of where the book launches are going to be. So there you go, across South Africa. Those are book launches for Spud Reunion. There's one in Lelouchia, which I think is Durban. Uh, Theatre on the in Santon, which is Joburg, and the BNA Waterfront, which is Cape Town. On the 20th of November for Cape Town. So let's have a look at that. And then we got a bookmark. We got a bookmark. <coughs> Apologies. Spider Reunion is out now. Happy book birthday. We have an exclusive books voucher. I'm not sure, but I think it's a 200 rounds voucher. It doesn't actually say. Yes, because I need a book. A retail. I need retail therapy. And we have a chocolatey. A lovely text, wait for chocolate. Mm. I'm gonna eat that now, now. And a finished copy of the book, thank you so much. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, 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 oh. Mm -hmm. You can pause to read or you can go and check Goodreads. There you go. New book smell gets me. Why do books smell different? Some books smell different than others. I don't know. But there you go. Dun, 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 dun. Thank you, Pam McMillan. Pam McMillan Kids for sending me this box. Um, now, all I can say about this box is that this is a perfect example. A perfect example of a genderless PR box. It doesn't need to be... How often do you see a man-coded box? And this is specifically for like um, Dimana, you know, all these straight things like Liz Pride, blah, blah, blah. But all these PR boxes normally contain uh, scrunchies and earrings, necklaces, and, and, and nail polishes, and, and seriously, and tumblers, and la la la. Not everybody uses these things. Do I look like I wear earrings and I need scrunchies in my hair? Do I look like I'm a, I'm a necklace kind of a guy? No. So, yeah, so this is perfect. Non genderless, there is no need for things to be used or given away. Used only in stock, as in as in as in nothing, or given away to somebody else. La, la, la. 
No, no, no. Thank you. I'll do some close-ups. See you next video. Mwah.